Welcome to the five tips to maximizing LinkedIn for your job search. This is being presented by the College of Liberal Arts Career Services Office at the University of Minnesota. LinkedIn is a website designed to help you manage your professional identity, connect with others, and find job opportunities, and is used widely in many career fields. Create Creating your profile is the first step toward utilizing LinkedIn. It doesn't have to be perfect to use the tool for research. LinkedIn walks you through the process step by step. At a minimum, we recommend including a photo of yourself. It doesn't have to be professionally taken, but should represent how you want to be viewed in a workplace setting. A headshot or a photo of your shoulders and above is ideal. You will also want to include your education. College only is fine. You don't need to include your high school. A few of your past experiences, whether they be work, volunteer, or projects at school, and add a headline and summary section. The best way to learn what kind of profile you want is to look at the profiles of others. You can also search on LinkedIn Learning for the Rock Your Profile workshop to learn much, much more about how to maximize your profile. The next step is to control your online presence. LinkedIn is also a useful way for you to do this. Employers are very likely to search for you on LinkedIn, so make it worth their while. You also get to present yourself as you want to, not how you may come across from Googling. It is recommended to Google yourself. You can use an incognito window so Google isn't recognizing your identity to see what comes up. It may surprise you. LinkedIn is a way for you to control what exists on the internet about you. The next step is to build your connections. One of the most basic ways that people use LinkedIn is to maintain connections with others. You can use this as much as you want to. If you are connecting with individuals you do not already know, we do recommend customizing your invitation request, which is easier to do from a computer versus a mobile device or tablet. Check the networking video on CLA's YouTube page to learn more about using LinkedIn to network with individuals you don't know. You can also use LinkedIn to connect with people you already know you may be surprised to learn that a neighbor or family friend works in a career that you're interested in. You can use this tool to connect with friends, classmates, instructors, and more. LinkedIn does have a tool that you can use your email to search for contacts, but make sure to go through that list first before sending anything out. The next thing to think about is how to use LinkedIn for actual job searching. LinkedIn does have job postings, and you can use the tool to apply for jobs. It is often most effective to see if you can use LinkedIn to find open positions, but then look at the company's website to see if there's a more direct way to apply. If you are job searching, the more complete your profile is, the better it will set you up for employers to find you. You can seek endorsements and be strategic about pinning the top three skills that are featured on your main profile page, asking former work or internship site supervisors to write and post a two to three sentence recommendation is a nice bonus to maximize your profile for future job seeking. But don't let these recommendations keep you from creating a basic profile to start. We also recommend using LinkedIn as one part of your job search process. Using GoldPass powered by Handshake often is more targeted because these employers are actively recruiting U of M students and alumni. The most effective way of seeking jobs is to connect with others to learn about opportunities before they are posted. You can use LinkedIn to start that process. You also can change a setting in your profile to indicate that you are actively seeking jobs. This will allow recruiters to contact you, and you can always turn it off if you find it overwhelming. One of the best ways to use LinkedIn is to use it to research companies and career paths. LinkedIn is not only for job seekers and those actively applying for positions. 
As a student, LinkedIn is a wonderful resource for you to research your options. You can learn more ab about what others with your same major has, have done after graduating by using the LinkedIn Alumni Tool. You can find this by searching for the University of Minnesota and then clicking Alumni on the U of M page. You can sort this information by major, location, and more to explore alumni pathways. More details about how to use this tool can be found in the networking video on the CLA Career Services YouTube page. This is a great way for you to see the many people who are on LinkedIn from the University of Minnesota and learn more about what they ended up doing after graduation. This can also help you to see where you may end up five to 10 years, but also show you what those people did during college. Did they do an internship? What were their student positions? Where did they volunteer? Did they need to get a graduate degree to do what they're doing now? Did they go right away to grad school after undergrad? Using this tool to look at many individuals can help answer those questions instead of relying on learning from only one person's experience or advice. You can also use LinkedIn to research companies. Look up their company page on LinkedIn, see who works there and what their backgrounds are. You might find out that most of the people there have a similar educational and work path, or that their employees come from a, a variety of backgrounds. You can also see which employees are alums from the University of Minnesota, so you know that you have that in common. If you have an interview coming up, this is a great way to learn about who may be interviewing you. Do note that LinkedIn allows people to see when others have viewed their profile, but you can turn that off in your settings. If you do turn that off, you will also not be able to see who viewed your profile. We have many ways for you to get help with your LinkedIn profile. A good first step is to come to a drop-in with a peer advisor. They can look over your profile and help you to think of ways to improve it. If you want more support, you can also set up an individual appointment with a career counselor. You also may want to check out the information we have about LinkedIn on our website, in the Career Readiness Guide, and the extensive resources available via LinkedIn Learning. Thank you for joining us for this LinkedIn video, and we hope to see you in CLA Career Services soon.